Hi, and welcome once again to Zara Vint's video blog, Russian Survival Guide. I'm Maya Krivchenya, your opera singer here for you today, presenting you with main dishes of the Russian food. The first dish we would like to present to you is Katlety Pajarskaya. It's made from chicken and breadcrumbs. First, they take the chicken and they grind it and make it into what they call in Russian a katlety. But in English, we usually just call this a meatball. Um, then they bread it with breadcrumbs. As you can see, they put very large breadcrumbs on this one. And then they bake it in the oven. Along with this, we have a lovely, lovely um, serving of grechka, which is a traditional um, grain for Russian people to eat. Usually you can have it just by itself. You can have it with masla, um, but it would go very well with your um, katliety. Our next dish is beef stroganoff. It's a very famous dish around the world, and it actually has a really interesting story behind it. It is said that after the Count Stroganov went to war, he lost his hand and could no longer eat his favorite dish of beef steak. And so his wonderful chef Pover decided to cut the steak up into small pieces and mix it with his famous sauce made with mushrooms, onions, and sour cream, and turned it into a special dish named after the Count himself and called it beef stroganoff. It is often eaten with mashed potatoes as a side. Over here, we have Russian plameni. They're basically dumplings, filled usually with meat, maybe sometimes vegetables if you prefer, and they're eaten with um, smetana or sour cream. This is the way the Russians eat them. You usually boil them first, and then when they're done, you take them out of the water and put the smetana or sour cream on top of them. Lastly, we have another traditional dish. It's called borscht or beet soup. It's made with beets, usually in some sort of beef broth, and also carrots, and some um, tomato sauce as well. Often it's also served with smetana or sour cream, and it's a very popular traditional dish that every household makes, and pretty much every Russian loves. I hope you enjoy these special Russian treats the next time you come and visit Russia.